Good morning, besties. It's June, Thursday the 15th, and I wanted to start vlogging because this is gonna be part of my new series, which is my Loving Life Diaries. I thought it was a cute name, and I love the like, concept, you know? But for this one, I thought we would do a whole reading vlog because I need to do a reading vlog for this book if I'm gonna read it. Like, I cannot not do one. <laughs> I'm gonna catch you guys up a little bit on the book that I'm currently reading, but I just, I'm struggling. I'm struggling, you guys. I'm struggling. It's Icebreaker by Hannah Grace. Okay, the reason that I'm struggling to read this, I'm on page 64, but I cannot stand the main female character's attitude for the life of me. Like, to me, it's the most annoying thing. Like, she's very rude and her, like, mindset is just, I don't know, her mind is, I, I don't like how she thinks how she acts, what she says, um, I don't know, like, I, do, I don't like it, like, the guy is nice, I like the guy, the girl just makes me want, want to, like, punch her in the face, like, I am not sure if I'm going to continue this book. I'm gonna put it down because if I keep reading, it's gonna put me in a reading slump, and no. So, so the book that I'm gonna read is Fourth Wing by Rebecca Yeros, and this is the book, I cannot wait to read this, I've heard such great things amazing things i think this one has like one of the best reviews on goodreads in a really long time and this one is chunky like this is gonna be a whole ride i am sure of it it's 7 49 a.m um i have a few things that i need to do today so I'm, i can't be reading all day wish i could but i'm gonna start right now and read for maybe like an hour straight and then I will start by my responsibilities. I'm having my first cup of coffee in a while and I'm excited. Cheers. By the way, um, I don't think I like told you guys why I stopped drinking coffee. Um, you guys know that I'm like a big, big coffee girl. Coffee is like my little favorite thing in the entire world, but I kind of messed up in like December and January. I drank too much coffee for me, for my body. Um, I've always drank coffee. That's just been part of me since I was like 15 years old, but I kind of like took it to an extreme. I drank like three cups of coffee a day, which for me that is way too much and it messed up my hormones and my cortisol levels so badly. So I had to like, I not, well, kind of had to, but I really wanted to. I switched to matcha because it's natural, it has antioxidants. Make sure to eat something before you drink coffee or any type of caffeine. And try not to drink any type of caffeine on an empty stomach because it can mess up your hormones, your cortisol levels, and just set you up for kind of a bumpy ride. I just bought like 25 books. <laughs> a lot of them are part of the summer book TBR and I also got other ones that I wanted to read. I'm so excited. And I'm gonna pay so much for shipping but it doesn't matter because I'm so excited.
Monday the 19th and I haven't filmed in a couple of days because I haven't read anything. Well, I did read another book, but I haven't continued reading Fourth Wing. It's 1.27 p.m. and I wanted to have a video for you guys for tomorrow, but I just know that I like I don't have anything planned, so I don't want to rush anything. Um, so I'm just going to have this video up for you guys. Thursdays. So I need to keep reading. So let's do it. I'm on page 33 and honestly it's been kind of a, a little bit confusing um, reading this book. Uh, it just has a lot of things going on and so many words that I just really don't know what they mean. And I'm starting to think that these are like made up words because I like Google them. I'm on that level. I Google them and they just don't exist. So let's continue reading and see how I like it. But to give you guys a little recap, so the main character is Violet. Violet, um, I honestly don't even know how old she is, but anyways, um, Violet was supposed to enter the scribe quadrant, but her mother, which is the commanding general, ordered Violet to actually try out for the dragon riders to be a dragon rider. So it's like a whole different quadrant, but, but kids actually grow up doing what they want to do. And she doesn't know a thing about being a dragon rider, so basically she's going in blind because, she, because her mother told her to. So, yeah. She does have a sister, though, that's a dragon rider. But her father died, and her father was part of the scribe quadrant. That was why the plan was for Violet to be part of the scribe quadrant as well as her dad but since her dad died her mother is like calling all the shots and she basically told Violet that she was going to be a dragon rider because she wanted to <laughs> so that's fun um let's continue reading I'm on page 142 and I can't stop reading like I feel like I've been reading for so long, but it still feels like I've read a lot. It's just like you get so hooked with what's happening that you just need to keep reading and keep reading. And like, I don't have like a single negative thing to say about Violet yet, <laughs> but like, I love her mentality. I love what she's doing. I love her will and like her whole mind and her thought process is addictive. Like. Okay, so Violet has been training to be a dragon rider, but but think about it like college, like first year, second year, third year. So she's a first year with like 180 people more. You cannot back out of this championship, if you will, if you want to call it something, championship. Because if you back out, you die. You basically die. So if you're in there, you're in there. Um, and every challenge and every like competition it's like you die or you live and a lot of people in there want to kill her because of her mother the commanding general so you never want to stop reading because every single thing that happens to this girl it's like i'm just like grabbing the book so intensely just nervous for her like at one point i was sweaty and i haven't even got into the actual like threshing whatever if you know you know but oh my gosh i'm just hooked now Okay, like I, I need to finish this book. I'm, I'm gonna finish this. I finished the book. It's literally 11 a.m. I haven't stopped reading since I like started reading today. I absolutely love this book with my whole heart. So good. I cannot wait for the second one. I I know there's gonna be like like four more books. I think it's gonna be like a five part series. <sighs> just literally cannot wait. If you guys like the Throne of Glass series, you just need to read this. It just gives me those vibes. Um, but so much better, like so much better. The writing style is perfect. I loved Violet and Satan. 
He is literally perfect. I loved all the um, adventure and I loved all the fighting scenes and everything and the last like 100 pages is everything. I was going to say this at the beginning of the, like, the video when I started reading, but Dane gives me the ick. He just, I, I don't like him. I don't like him at all. And like throughout the book, he was just so annoying. He was the most annoying person. He was literally so pessimistic. And he literally would say the most awful things to Violet because he was protecting her. Like, no. And also absolutely hate Violet's mother. Like annoying and awful. Like what the hell, what kind of mother? And I knew that if I didn't like the ending and like the last 100 to 150 pages, I would not rate the book five stars, but it deserves the five stars. You guys, you need to read it. Like, that's all I have to say. Also, this is not part of um, anything in the book. This is just my speculation, but something is weird and kind of off with Vias's sister, Myra. If you learned anything from this video, go read the book. Also, it does have quite a few like spicy scenes. Um, I didn't feel like they were very, very detailed and graphic. Like it's not like a romance, dark romance where like it's very graphic, you know. Um, but it does have quite a few spicy scenes, which is not YA. So it's more on that like um, a new adult level and not so much YA level, just to keep that thing just to keep that in mind. So I hope you guys liked the video. Make sure to subscribe down below and turn on the notification bell so you can notify when I upload more videos. But I will see you in my next video. Bye!